Uh, Guruji, I, I got a question for you. Uh, can you comment about your laughter? I've I'm seen sorry? a lot of people laugh, but nobody laughs like you. <laughs> you have such a joyful laugh, it comes of from course, your everybody from laughs within. differently, so what's the problem with that? <laughs> See, uh, these days these kind of things are going on, some pathetic, a pathetic kind of yoga is going on. People call this laughing yoga, okay? Both of us stand in front of each other and say, you say he he he, I say he 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 <laughs> This is crazy. See, this is like, you… you understand there must be flowers in the garden. If you want flowers in the garden, you don't buy plastic flowers and fix it there. You have to do something which doesn't look like flowers. You have to handle the soil, you have to handle the manure, water, sunlight. None of them look like flowers, none of them feel like flowers, none of them smell like flowers. But if you handle these things right, flowers will come. So laughter will come not because you have taken a stand, every day I must laugh for… You no, know, because just recently I was reading somewhere, somebody is advising one American uh, to-do teachers, you know, what are the things you must do? Every day, ten minutes a day, you must laugh <laughs> You will be in the psychiatry department soon <laughs> If you are in a certain state of pleasantness within you, without knowing why, a smile will spread on your face. With a very little tickle, you will laugh <laughs> So, laughter is a consequence. Don't try to create the consequence. You work this process, the source.